Hello everyone. Do you ever wonder how Discord servers have their own custom little logos for their roles? Well, in today's video I'm going to show you how they do that and how you can make your own right now in literally seconds. You may have noticed that on some roles on Discord there is a little icon that is associated with that role and I bet you probably wondered how they get them, you know, do they just randomly look up an image online? Do they make them themselves from scratch or whatever? You're probably wondering how to do this, so I'm going to show you how to do it right now. So what you're going to want to do is go into your browser and you're going to go to discordicon.com and you'll be brought to this main website here that says customize your roles icon. That is right, there is an official site for creating your own custom role icons, uh, which I actually previously did not know uh, that this was a thing, uh, but this is a thing and this is how you can do it. And this is a lot easier than trying to create your own by uh, you know putting shapes together and stuff like that It's a lot easier and a lot more simple because you could do this in literally 30 seconds So once you're on this website here, it'll look a little bit like this and there'll be a huge Layout of all the different symbols that they offer and there's three different tabs that you could go through here uh, So the first tab is the icons tab. So this is the little icon that is in the center There's so many different ones to choose from you can make uh, You can make a lot of different ones with this uh, for depending on which type of role that you're adding it to um, so let's just do a simple one. So we're going to do just a moderator. Oops, uh, sorry, a moderator symbol here. Uh, by the way, the ones that are yellow are for probably for their uh, their premium version. Uh, so you won't be able to use those. But there's a lot of different uh, options. There's also many <laughs> multiple pages of different symbols that they offer here. So first you choose the inner logo here. Then you go to customize shape. And then you could choose the outer shape of this. So you've probably seen some of these shapes before, such as the shield or such as uh, this shape here that they use for, I believe, the uh, the um, the Discord mod uh, one. Uh, and then they also have you know different versions of the shield here, and of course a star and a triangle. But you could obviously mix and match these as best that you want. Uh, so we're just going to go with this shield here, just that looks kind of cool. And you could also rotate the symbol around, and as you can see there is a square grid here, uh, but you could rotate it in any direction you'd like. Uh, and then we have a color here, so you can actually change uh, the color of the actual uh, logo here. Uh, and then you can also choose a border color around here and the thickness. So let's say if I wanted a 5, there you go. So now we have a red border. Uh, and then you can also add a background image if you want, but you'll have to upload your own. I probably wouldn't recommend this. You probably just want the roll symbol to be decently small. Uh, but you can actually see the preview right below here beside cast Captain Astro. And you can see what it looks like uh, beside the user if they do have that role. And you have these uh, emojis enabled. Uh, and then lastly, there is the customized icon. So you could change the position of it, uh, the scale of it, uh, and of course the rotation of it. So you could make this very customized uh, if you'd like. Uh, and you could also change the color uh, of the actual symbol itself. And you could add a border to the symbol just like uh, how the other one is so if you make this black there you go so now we have a border there and you could also add a glowing shadow which is pretty nice and change the color of this glowing shadow so there's a lot of different things that you could do with this to make this really 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 cool uh, and you can also change you know the the uh, position of the shadow and how much a blur it is so if you move the blur up it'll be more uh, spread out here as you can see and if you lower it down to like five or so then it's like just barely uh, going around the outline so once you're done all of that and you are happy with the logo that you like, you can actually swap these out. Look at that one. There's the uh, uh, the bot developer one. So many different ones you could do. These actually look pretty cool. Uh, but anyways, once you do like uh, like the symbol that you created, then you just click download and it will download as a PNG. And you can always open the PNG just to make sure it's perfect. As you can see, there's no background, so you don't have to worry about you know removing the background or anything like that. Now, the only thing is with these symbols is that you do need boosts on your server. I believe you need level 2, I think. So if you go to your roles and you try and choose an image, yes, yeah, so you need level 2 uh, boosting, which basically is... Let's go to uh, the server boost. Here we go. Uh, so it's basically 7 boosts. So you need 7 boosts <laughs> on your Discord server uh, to get the actual emojis... Or, sorry, to get the actual uh, custom role icons uh, beside your emojis. Uh, but nonetheless, though, if you don't have it, you might be able to somehow uh, get it implemented in another way. Uh, but this is if you do have boosts, then you can actually just straight up upload uh, the image beside it. Uh, but essentially, though, that is how uh, these Discord servers that you might be in are getting these really nice custom symbols uh, beside their names. 
uh, and they're not just creating it or just downloading random images online which is totally possible too uh, but for these really clean ones I think they're probably just doing that uh, because there's just so many different options uh, to actually choose from here now quickly before this video ends I want to remind you guys that we did recently hit a thousand subscribers a few days ago and there is a uh, giveaway for three months of discord nitro or in other words three winners and one month each so you have three times the chance of winning uh, so please join my discord server the discord link is in the description below if you would like to join the giveaway there is only 10 more days from the uh, from today uh, posting this video which is the 14th uh, so if you'd like to join please join my server other than that though i hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial please subscribe and be prepared for my next video because i have a lot in store uh, for this channel and of course thank you very much for watching my tutorials and i'll see you guys in the next video bye bye